welcome back to notacoolmom.com. Today we're at our local orchard. They have cherries, strawberries, and later in the season they'll have apples and pumpkins. The strawberries are just ready to get picked. And coming to the orchard is a great way to spend time outside with the family. We're gonna go pick some strawberries. We just visited the goats and I'll show you around. Let's go take a look. There are more than just fruits and vegetables to see at this orchard. There are tons of activities for kids, which is one of the reasons why we chose it. There's also animals. There were lots of little bunnies and little chicks, and you could also see how bees make honey. The kids were amazed with how many bees it took to make just a little bit of honey. In addition to the bunnies and bees, there were also some really aggressive and hungry goats that nearly knocked me over. I'm just taking Whoa! Is it a quarter? Yeah. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Look at this guy's really cut. You want to try it? You want to do the little baby one? They were more gentle with Noah and Henry, but you cannot believe how ticklish it is to have a goat eat out of your hands. We did some research before we chose which orchard to go to. We chose this one because of all the great activities it has for kids, including an enormous playground with trains and tractors. We also chose this orchard because they use organic practices, and we knew that our kids would be able to be eating the vegetables that we were picking without having pesticides get into their systems. Are you driving the tractor? Right. Yeah? <laughs> what? Wow. Wheels are hard. Whoa. Do they have a donut? They have This is their kitchen. It's a big kitchen, right? Well, unfortunately, there weren't any strawberries available to be picked today, but we'll definitely come back in a few weeks. As you can see, there were plenty of other things to do. Check out the local orchards in your area, and for other ideas on things to do with your kids, check out notacoolmom.com. Mommy! <laughs>